I'm willing to like uh, entertain that that could get they could get better and better at. But I still don't know if it would pose that question to itself or or really be prompting itself curiously ever. And yeah. you know, you there know, are some inevitable advantages of of the sand intelligence compared to biological intelligence that it will be very difficult to you know control at some point. But but at any rate. I think, in a sense, there will be division of worlds. There is the artificial computation that has these obvious advantages, and you know, the other, the other is not just the human now or the animal. The other is now the entire biological world. So I, think I hope that's you're right. Good. <laughs> I hope you're right about that. I, I'm afraid someone will discover the root of curiosity and find a way to feed it to the machine somehow like if if it really just comes down to checking inconsistencies in the whole body of knowledge inside of yourself then it might be that the computers could be trained to have these emotional responses these anxieties about inconsistencies in their universe and yeah. really become motive agents that are trying to make a more self-consistent world for themselves